In this demonstration, I'm going to use some shaving cream. So I'm going to take some shaving cream and I'm going to put that in the chamber. Okay. And we'll put it in a beaker to contain it and throw some shaving cream in this container here. And that should be more than enough. All right. Shaving cream is another example of a colloid that we talked about. If we just did the marshmallows, which is a very famous demonstration, we had air trapped in a solid. Now we have air trapped or gas trapped in a liquid. Turning on our vacuum pump, you can see that the air volume or the gas trapped is going to expand as pressure decreases. And we can see clearly that it fills up the entire vacuum chamber full of shaving cream. Now we don't have any more shaving cream, it's just that the gas expanded. In fact, a lot of that gas has been drawn out. So just like the marshmallow, if you watch that one, what I'm going to do now is turn off the vacuum pump and as I always say, when I pull out this cord here, the pressure is going to rush back in. And because I drew out all the what? The gas, okay, most of the gas, whatever gas is left in this uh, liquid, which is the foam, is expanded out greatly. So as I bring back the pressure, remember Boyle's Law, as I decrease the pressure, the volume of the gas that was trapped in the liquid expanded. And now as I increase the pressure, it should push it back in. It's not going to push it back the way it came. So I always say that this is your... Brain, and this is your brain on drugs! <laughs> Don't do drugs. Ball's law.